This is a quick guide to installing PrimeHack. You can download PrimeHack directly or you can use the PrimeHack updater. To use the updater, all you need to do is download it and put it into a folder of your choice and run it. This will now automatically download the latest update. Once it has finished downloading, it will ask you whether or not you want to use the updater to boot directly into the Metroid Prime Trilogy. If you say yes, it will ask you for the location of your game. If you would like it to prompt you again, all you need to do is go to the updated config and remove this line. To add your game, all you need to do is double click this window and select the folder containing your Metroid Prime Trilogy ISO. As of right now, PrimeHack only works with the Metroid Prime Trilogy. We cannot provide you this game as that would be illegal. If you would like some advice on how to get your own version of the game, please refer to the Dolphin Wiki on dumping your games. This is everything you need to play Prime Trilogy with PrimeHack. To view or change PrimeHack settings, you must go to Controllers, Configure and then the PrimeHack tab. Here you can change your settings such as your field of view as well as the buttons you press to select your beams and your visors. The buttons for beams and visors are required because you can't move the cursor inside the game. For further information on how to improve your frame rate and how to deal with certain visual glitches please refer to the PrimeHack wiki.